with stars in their eyes. Please welcome your host, Matthew Kelly. Tell you and get ready for the gig of a lifetime because this is Stars in Their Eyes, where we invite you to join us on a trip through Music's Hall of Fame. Rock and roll is nearly 50 years old, but showing no signs of zipping up its woolly slippers and taking up gardening. It's as fresh and vital today as it was when Elvis had great hips, Chuck Berry had great legs, and Jerry Lee Lewis had great balls of fire. <laughs> Fashion changes, music changes, but the song remains the same. Literally, if your steps. <laughs> the clothes may not always be timeless, but the music is. And here's our friend Electric, star guest number one. Hi, I'm Brett Buckland. I'm from Exeter and I work for an electrical superstore. Mm -hmm. I've been working now with this electrical superstore for 10 years. No two days are the same. I travel around to different shops and I really love my job. When we found out that Brett was going to be on show, fantastic. Um, you can always hear him humming around the shop floor. Um, got a tune, fair play to him. He's a uh, good lad, like, I hope he does really well. Time to go away. First time I ever appeared in public, I was six years old, and I sang at my mum and dad's uh, country and western club, yeah, where we used to live in Lambourne, um, and they got me to yodel but it was fantastic, I really enjoyed it. I can still do it now, actually. Now he's this side of the screen, please welcome Brett Buckland. <laughs> yeah. Never leaves you, does it, really? Uh, Never leaves you. Go. Now, come on, be honest. You're just paid to watch TV all day in that shop, aren't you? No, not really, no. There was uh, something like 60 channels that are on at the moment. Fantastic! Who could want for more? <laughs> yeah, they're getting more each day. How weird. Don't you love them? Yeah, fantastic, yeah. What's yeah, the brilliant. weirdest channel you've ever come across? Bearing in mind what time the show goes yeah. out, obviously. Well, there's actually one channel that we actually watched one evening when mm. we was working late, and it was uh, two Japanese guys. Somebody was throwing a hula hoop to one of them, and then they was headbutting them back over, trying to get it over a pole. <laughs> And that just went on for hours. It was just, it was... The Hula Hoop <laughs> Channel, one of my favourites! That's right. Tell us about this person you're going to be tonight. Well, he grew up in Miami. Uh, his family are from Cuba. Um, he's the front man for the Mavericks country band, and he's very famous for his goatee beard. He is indeed. Tell us who you're going to be tonight, Brett. Tonight, Matthew, I'm going to be Raul Mallow. Raul Mallow! A real life Maverick! Tonight, singing live, Brett Buckland is Raul Like 
Lovely time. <laughs> yeah, it was getting good heavens. Oh. From a six year old Yodeler to a 36 <laughs> year old Maverick. You know, the real Raoul Mallow said that the Mavericks were all about enjoying yourself and entertaining people. Well, mission accomplished. You looked like you were enjoying yourself. Yeah, I was. Yeah, you were, weren't you? <laughs> you are a top bloke, I'm telling you. you you've been great to have on the show, honestly. Ladies much. and gentlemen, Brett Buckland as Raoul Mallow. <laughs> If you're a pop star, you know you've really made it big when your doppelganger finally walks through those doors. Yes, pop idols, Brit Awards and gold discs mean nothing until your name appears in the phrase, tonight, Matthew, I'm going to be... In the next few minutes, one new indie star will join our Hall of Fame. Who is it? We'll find out from star guest number two. Hi, my name's Tony Shaw and I'm from Daventry, Northamptonshire. I've been working at the Plum Centre a couple of months now and I really enjoy it because I work with a great bunch of lads. This is a picture of me and my fiance on the holiday in Greece. We got very drunk on cocktails and we did now feel it in the morning. This next one is my mum and I love to call her Mummy Bear. This next photo is a picture of our family pet, Fat Black. Well, when I first found out I got on the show, my mouth just opened and I ran around the shop jumping off the shelves going, woohoo! Fine set of pipes on the way from Tony Shaw! <laughs> so, Tony, you're normally a confident person, aren't you? Yeah, you tell me I'm a natural habitat and I'm not a rabbit in headlights. I'm just, ooh. So, is this a bit of an eye opener for you? Definitely. Yeah, well, you mate Richard's there and, um, and Lisa, your fiance, have they given you any advice? Yeah, it was to be myself, really, and, you know, enjoy myself, which is quite ironic, cos the idea of the show is to be someone totally different. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're absolutely right. And as you are going to be somebody different, you better tell me something about him. I'm going to do a song of their debut album, Love Is Here, and I'm going to be the front man from their band, Star Sailor. So tell us who you're going to be tonight. Tonight, tonight. Matthew, I'm going to be James Walsh. James Walsh! Captain of the Good Ship Stars tonight! Singing live, Tony Shaw is James Walsh! Say no one 
Yeah, OK. First line of that song, to me, is all about stars in their eyes. As soon as you sound like him, give me a call. You see? <laughs> you sounded like him, you give us a call, you conquered. Oh, look, you see, Mummy Bear is very proud of Baby Bear. <laughs> I think it's extra porridge for you tonight. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Tony Shaw as James Walsh. <laughs> you see, if you want to be a star of stars but haven't found the right voice yet, keep listening to those charts. Eventually, you'll hear a new vocal style that's right up your street. And then you're just one tape and a couple of auditions from that immortal portal. <laughs> We'd still love to see Eminem behind closed doors, but then so would the LAPD. Join us after the break for more chart changelings and me. The real Slim Shady. True. Ah, <laughs> oh, there you are. Welcome back to Stars in Their Eyes, stamping pop passports with a temporary vocal visa. Our next star has been happily married since 1967. Not actually to the same man. Uh, in fact, her marriage certificates come stamped with a best before date. One thing she has kept, though, is her legendary status. And making the great leap into superstardom is star guest number three. Hi, my name's Carolyn Cullen. I'm 27 and I come from Sheffield. I'm doing a charity ad sale in a couple of months and I've come for a practice run on this bridge. Um, I love the film that the song was from and I sang it at karaoke to do something different and it, I just really love singing it. Go on, Karen! <laughs> <laughs> I'm really looking forward to coming out through the doors on the night and um, just really enjoying singing the song. When we found out Carolyn was on the show, we were really happy for her, really pleased. I was probably more nervous than she was. I'll do it again now. <laughs> Wearing a different kind of hard hat tonight, Carolyn Cullen! <laughs> It amazes me the number of shy, retiring people who come on the show, and Carolyn is one of them. Your workmates are going to be really shocked that you're here tonight. But you've been singing all your life, haven't you, Carolyn? Yeah, I've um, always sung, really, as long as I can remember. Um, I've sung to my mum, my dad, friends, empty rooms, anywhere, really. <laughs> well, what, mostly empty rooms? Mostly empty rooms, yeah. Mm, yeah. I know, yes. <laughs> well, I know that feeling. Empty. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, if you're so quiet and shy, and you really, honestly, she really is, why are you here? <laughs> well, um, last Christmas I decided that life was too short and decided to do... Um, to push myself a bit and uh, do the abseiling, been doing some singing, and I'd like to do a parachute jump next. Next? <laughs> All you have to do now is tell me a bit about this person, because it's so not like you, this person you're going to be. It's not, no. She had a very famous mother, who was the movie icon Judy Garland. She was. And um, the song I'm going to be singing tonight is the title song from the film that won her an Oscar, and that film is Cabaret. Tell us who you're going to be tonight. Tonight, Matthew, I'm going to be Liza Minnelli. Liza Minnelli! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Dominic Herman, tonight, singing live, Carolyn Cullen is Liza Minnelli! Sitting alone in the room, can't hear the music play. Life is a cabaret, oh son. Come to the cabaret. Put down the knitting, the book, and the broom. It's time for a Taste the wine, come hit the band, come go your horn, start celebrating, but this way your table's waiting. What good's permitting some profit of doom to wipe every smile away? Life is a cabaret all time, so come to the cabaret. I used to have this girlfriend. 
been known as Elsie Went through my shed for sordid rooms in Chelsea She wasn't what you'd call a blushing flower As a matter of fact, she rented by the hour The day she died, the neighbors came to snicker Well, that's what comes from too much pills and liquor But when I saw her laid out like a queen She was the happiest corpse I'd ever seen And as for me, ha, and as for me I made my mind up back in Chelsea If you're the quiet one in the office, <laughs> what are the loud ones like? It always amazes me, you know, when people like you come on the show and you always look so terrified. And you are terrified, aren't you, yeah. really? And I think, <laughs> why do they put themselves through it? And every time, like people like you, you come out like that and I see exactly why you do it. Because you're good and you can do it. It's more of a, and I know you hide behind the character. Do you know that? So, do you think that suits her? <laughs> that mob? So do the suspenders, but I'm not going into that. <laughs> no, look, come on. <laughs> Behave yourselves. Ladies and gentlemen, Carolyn Cullen as Liza Minnelli. <laughs> Another legend arrived, but you couldn't find greater musical opposites. This star has never worn lipstick, tights and suspenders, so that's Jason Donovan out of the running. <laughs> this guy changed the face of music forever. So that's Jason Donovan still out of the frame. Getting in the frame, though, is star guest number four. Hi, my name's Kevin Daly. This is my house where I live in Potton End in Hertfordshire. I'm a gardener. I've been gardening for about 15 years now. I work for 10 or so people in the area, and I love it. The thing I really love about gardening is being out in the sunshine. Weeds. First time I did any singing in public, anyway, was uh, at school pantomime. I had to sing a very silly song dressed as the Sheriff of Nottingham. I met Jane, my girlfriend, about three years ago. We actually met at a, when we were both taking part in a play in an amateur dramatics group. And I was the wicked sheriff. And she was a, a punk teddy bear. She had very cute ears. About to sow the seeds of change, it's Kevin Daly! <laughs> now, that is a great shirt. Kevin is a very unusual name. Where'd you get that? It's actually an Irish name. It's a county in Ireland. Uh -huh. My mum and dad named us all after places that kind of were important to them. For example, my brothers, Rannoch, Morven, Karen. They're all uh, lochs and glens in Scotland where my mum and dad used to cycle when they were first married. Lovely. My sister Shannon, she's up there. Oh, nice one. Uh, obviously named after the River Shannon. Oh, you see? <laughs> Just like the Beckhams, really, isn't oh. it? <laughs> <laughs> Could be, wouldn't it? <laughs> Tell me a bit about the person you're going to be, Kevin. He was born Robert Allen Zimmerman. He's written loads of songs that have been hits for other people, including Peter, Paul and Mary, Manfred Mann, Jimi Hendrix, even Guns N' Roses. He's also starred in a couple of films, Pat Garrett and Billy the Kid, and he starred as an ageing rock star in the film Hearts of Fire. Hardly a fan at all, is he? <laughs> Tell us who you're going to be tonight. Tonight, Matthew, I'm going to be Bob Dylan. Bob Dylan! <laughs> There's no for dealers focus tonight. Singing live, Kevin Daly is... Hey, Mr. 
Thanks. Seen here modelling the Help the Aged Winter Collection. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know Bob Dylan himself in that song, Absolutely Sweet Marie, said, Well, anybody can be just like me, obviously. No, they can't, Bob. It takes <laughs> talent to be like you. <laughs> Honestly, and it really does. You've got some talent. Isn't it funny that when that song came out in 1965 that you just sung, you were only two years old and I wasn't even born. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Kevin Daly as Bob Dylan! <laughs> if you'd like an application form for stars, call 090 It's 25p a go, a little more from a mobile, and you could be here paying tribute to your musical influences. Bob Dylan's Mr Tambourine Man is still an influential song for many boy bands because it's the only instrument most of them can actually play. <laughs> While Bob was the spokesman of the 60s, our next star was the outspokesman of the 80s, and he's on the way after these messages. Bye. of stars in their eyes and you're welcome to it. <laughs> if you're over 30, let me take you back to a rainy Thursday evening in 1982 when our next star began his career. Top of the Pops is on as you spill Vesta curry down your frilly shirt. <laughs> Grinning like a loon, Peter Powell introduces the next act and your world is changed forever. The next day, you're in detention for wearing eyeliner during rugby. <laughs> Who was responsible? Let's ask star guest number five. <laughs> Hi there, I'm Jason Barrow, I'm a nurse, I'm from Glasgow and I work here in Kyle Court. Wouldn't it be nice if we were older then we would have to wait so long? I've been a nurse now for 10 years, I find it very rewarding. I like working with people, 
and I find it very fulfilling. My family and friends would probably describe me as um, funny, outgoing, um, OTT at times, but I can be very shy. This is my horse Bailey, and she's a big girl. Um, she takes some handling at times, but she's got heart. Nurse the screens! Someone's got to change, and it's Jason Barrow! Yeah. I'm sorry to have to tell you that I think Jason looks so like the person that he's going to be. I bet a lot of you have guessed already, but I don't want you to say it. You're all going, oh, yeah, yeah. Let's see if they've guessed right. Tell me a bit about... Give me just a few clues. I was backstage at a gig in, in London uh, with a friend who's a singer, and uh, one of Womack and Womack's children, who they've got a big family, one of their kids came up to me and said, um, was that this person without his makeup on? Ah, uh, you see. Tell me some... Clues about the real person. Yeah. He was in a, a, a band in the early 80s. They had hits such as um, Do You Really Want To Hurt Me, Karma Chameleon. Um, he's a DJ and he's also a past winner of this show. He is, certainly is. Tell us who you're going to be tonight, Jason. Tonight, Matthew, I'm going to be Boy George. Boy George! <laughs> Kiss and makeup as tonight, singing live, Jason Barrow is Boy George! Take a picture of tonight and keep it by your heart. Love is dead with memories, there's no better way to part. I will find another love, someone who won't bring me down. How you tried to live on me, but you never stood your ground. Fortunately, I got a wife. I want to be loved Don't want to fight you, baby Cos I'm much too proud to say it now I, I just want to be loved Don't want to beg you, baby Cos I'm much too proud to shout it out now Oh, when you love someone Don't you know Love is blind Oh, when you love someone It'll be for all time In that shrine Fortunately, I got a wise this time Too proud to say it now. I, I just I wanna be loved. Don't wanna beg you, baby. Cause I'm much too proud to shout it out now. I just wanna be loved. I wanna be loved. I just wanna be loved. Your hands. <laughs> Ooh, it's like a slick, this. <laughs> a little bit nervous, yeah. right? Oh, I'm telling you, the voice, Boy George, the performance, Boy George, the hat, Dipsy from the Teletubbies. <laughs> Fantastic! <laughs> you know, you didn't need to give any verbal clues about who you were going to be, because you can do it with just one look, can't you? What's, 
<laughs> He's that good, ladies and gentlemen. Jason Barrow as Boy George. <laughs> Five spectacular star guests have shimmied through those doors. Now it's all down to these good people, the Brains Trust, to put one of them into the live grand final. But who will it be? Here's a reminder: Today. Brett Buckland as that maverick country boy, Raoul Mallow. I just want to dance and I... No Fool He, Tony Shaw as Star Sailor's James Walsh. You're just a fool. Carolyn Cullen as the Queen of Cabaret, Liza Minnelli. So come to the cabaret. Kevin Daly was a change in as Bob Dylan. Hey, Mr. Tambourine Man, play a song for me. And the jingle jingle morning, I'll come far. The boy done good, Jason Barrow was Boy George. This time the decision is theirs. But in the final, it'll be yours. So, studio audience, cast your votes now. We have a winner, is it? Raoul Mallow. James Walsh. Liza Minnelli. Bob Dylan. Or Boy George. And the winner is... Liza Minnelli! You see, I've no sympathy. You bring it on yourself. <laughs> you said you wanted adrenaline rush and life is too Not short. <laughs> Abseiling. Life is a cabaret. Life is a cabaret. Parachute <laughs> jumping. <laughs> Stars in their eyes. <laughs> Live final. <laughs> you don't get more adrenaline than that, do you? And you deserve to be there because it was tough competition. Everyone has been so great. I know, they've been a <laughs> really nice have. bunch, haven't they? Yeah. And so have you. It's Are you looking great. forward to the live final? Wow! <laughs> You've got a parachute <laughs> jump in between, never mind. <laughs> well, there you see. So, who's <laughs> Carolyn up against in the live grand final so far? Our first winner, William Brown, bringing back the 70s as Errol Brown. George Gordon as the newest Latin legend, Enrique Iglesias. Lisa Fletcher as the incomparable Sinead O'Connor. And last week's winner, Andy McCrink, as that working class hero, John Lennon. Thank you to all five-star guests for another fantastic evening. And before the live grand final beckons, let's see how Carolyn got stars in her eyes. Ladies and gentlemen, Carolyn Cullen as Liza Minnelli. Good night. <laughs>
As a matter of fact, she rented by the hour. The day she died, the neighbors came to snicker.